guys for doing another video here I haven't posted in a long time and I'm sorry for that. Is that I was busy, I was cleaning and everything like that. So what today we're gonna be doing is making the bookmarks with tape. All the materials that you need is tape, scissors, and a marker and some color if you want to, but I'm gonna do a plain one for this video today. Um please subscribe. Leave some comments down below on what videos you want me to do. And also, please subscribe. Hit the like button to 10 likes at least because I'm going to do an experiment of turning milk into plastic. And I don't know if that quite works yet. I looked it up in the internet, so I don't know if it's going to work. So if you want me guys to try that out, then... We can. I can. Only if you hit me up to 10 likes. And I did a video um, making I don't know. That's what the video is actually called. So I'm just going to be making like a shape of a bookmark. So you can put it on the long side or short side. It doesn't matter. So I'm just going to make and like this you don't have to make it that long i'm not gonna make it that long at the first try so as you can see this is um the shape of the bookmark you can do any patterns you'll like i'll just do some circles for now and some stars And then I'm gonna just cut it out and then we'll be making another bookmark, but differently. So as you can see the design, if you didn't see it that well, now I'm gonna be cutting it. You don't have to leave the black on um, if you don't want to, like the, the trace of the black. Not the designs, but the trace of the black. I'm just gonna leave a little bit on because I can't take the rest off. So here it is. If you want it to be like a little bit hard and bendy, you can use transparent tape so you can still see the designs. So I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna try not to use the... Okay, so I'm just gonna put tape I don't know how, how how I should put it. I'm just going to put it at the long side, like this. And then I'm going to cut it. And I'm going to show you guys so far. So you see the tape. I'm gonna fold it in like this. <laughs> like that. And not this side. And um, I'm gonna put some across. Um, oops. So I'm just gonna do this. It like that. Ugh. I'm messing up with the tape. Okay, like that. And you can just cut it again and do the same thing on with the other sides. I I know that you can't see the bookmark right now. I'll show you some. That was so easy to cut actually. So as you can see, I'm doing that across because I wanted to cover the whole bookmark up because I want it to be bendy. I don't want it to break that easily. This tape cannot break that easily. So, yeah. It's hard to put because there's a lot of bendy parts you can see so far now I'm gonna show you how I do it so 
I get the tape out. I put it on like like this. It's really hard to do it with one hand. Like that. Put it on like that. I don't have to put it on that already because I already did it. to do it is um, put on all the edges of the tape so it can be um, beautiful so I'm just gonna keep doing it this video is five minutes long so far okay that's good because we haven't done videos in a long time where is the tape Oh, here it is. Okay. Come on. Yes. Okay. That's good. Okay, guys. So. This is how it looks so far. It's shiny. Now I'm going to put some on the back because I don't want it to be like that. I'm going to do the same as I did to the front. The same exact thing. Oopsies, I put it on wrong. Oh no! Okay, you. Oops, I ripped some of the paper, but it's good that it wasn't on the other side. Okay, now let's take it on really good. <sighs> Guys, this is my first time doing a bookmark, so I'm sorry if I'm speaking long. The next, I think I'm going to do a second episode of this, because this is taking me a long time. <sighs> I'm just going to cut the tape that long and I'm just gonna find the tape again. Okay, I'm gonna put it on the bed. So, now what I'm gonna do is put this on the back. Like, like so. Good. And I have to look that beautiful. Now I'm gonna cut the remaining parts of the tape. Okay. Now we're done with the bookmark. And it's erasable, so you can write anything on this. Look, an erasable marker, and then let me show you guys. Okay, ready? So you can even write hi, and then you can erase it. You can erase it again so that's an erasable bookmark if you want to do it with tape you have to do it with a dry erase marker if you don't have one then you don't have to do one um, you can do it with tape but you you can do it with a lot of designs but not with erase marker if you don't have a erase marker so you can also put this on I'm just gonna put a, like little Thoughts. It's not erasable. I'm just putting it to be optional. I'm doing my neatest work right now to not mess up because it's my first bookmark. 
But I'm still gonna see if it's still erases, which I don't think it's gonna. It doesn't erase, it just um, ruined the bookmark, as you can see. But it's okay because I can just do a star at the bottom. I just. <sighs> but I'm gonna try because we saw this in five minutes crafts. If it can take off with some erasable marker, which I think I'm gonna. <gasps> Guys, <clears throat> it works. Look at. It you don't see anything. Okay, let me do something on the back. Ew, what did why did I do that? Look that and I can't erase. Look, it's just smudged. Uh now you just put some erase marker on it, just blend it in with the Erase marker, just blend it in, just play with it a little bit, like that, and then erase. You can't see anything. So that works, I thought it wasn't going to work. This is for sale. No, just kidding, not in YouTube, but um, this is for sale in real life, not in YouTube, but for real life, if you want this. I'm going to do colored ones, too. So, I'm going to try to do another one. I'm going to do a kind of like a sticky note one. And I'm just going to do like patterns like 